I'm going to review the, I guess, Ninja $1 Dart Blaster, Blow Blaster. Ninja Star, how would you say, Dollar? The one, the one dollar blow blaster from an unknown company. Three, two, one. Hello, everybody. This is Nerf Gun Reviewer three, three, one here today. Today's review, we're gonna be, I'm gonna be reviewing a really cheap and poorly made uh, dart blaster I got from a dollar store. I, I think it was Dollar Tree at the time. A green Dollar Tree or some shit like that. And basically, it's it's a blow blaster. You use your air to push the dart out. Instructions are simple. You load, load the dart in, and then blow it out from this end. I can easily see myself modifying this to maybe to like maybe make this hole just a tad bit bigger, so more air could go through and push out the dart further. Maybe add some. Maybe add like a little bit more CPVC or something. And to be con quite frankly, this, this feels like it's cheaply made. Then again, it's a dollar store, so it's only it's only be, it's only going to cost one dollar to make and one dollar to sell. Maybe it costs more to a dollar to make. This foam grip, I think, is pretty cool. But if you grip it too hard, you, you basically crush the plastic. That's how fragile this this whole thing is. And seeing that these darts don't really have a hole to it, as you can see here. You can't really load it into a Nerf blaster or any blaster that has that same hole in the foam thing. It came with five of these. It came with uh, a little dart holder, which is, which is kind of okay. It's at the same time pretty useless. Because what if the dart falls out or gets pushed out? Or, it, you can easily just pull this apart without using any assortment of force. You, you could easily just, just go flick it off. So imagine that with wind. Real wind. This piece can come off. It's a five dart holder. I wonder if this piece could come off. Nope, doesn't look like it. I'm just going to go right into the firing test since it's just so cheaply made. <laughs> that was cool. Dart landed right on the camera. So I could already see this can go like 10 feet, which is pretty, pretty shitty. It's like two of me laid down on the floor 10 to 15 feet and this I, I'm already disappointed in this then again this, it's a dollar store toy so it's not gonna make much of a difference uh, the darts itself the darts themselves look like they're really good foam but the tips feel like they're shit they're like they're shit tips now what if I were to load two of these would I get like a shotgun effect Yes. Shoot two darts. At an angle shot, it would probably be about 10, 15 feet. At a level shot, it would probably be about 5 to 10 feet. So, like, there's not really many pros, but there's a crap load of cons, so I'm not even going to get into that. So, like, overall, I give this 2 stars out of 10. It's probably a really bad blaster, but it's an off-brand. It's from a dollar store, it's cheaply made, so it, I mean, it deserves a review, at the same time it doesn't, because of how poor the quality is. Although, I am curious, if I had a Mega Dart from Nerf, would it launch, I'm pretty sure it would launch it, but I just don't know how far it would shoot. I guess that would be safe for a different video, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video of the Dollar, the dollar Tree Nerf, like, ripoff of a Blow Blaster. Or Busby. And uh, like I said, it only costed a buck. It came with the five darts, the, the dart holder, and a little piece of plastic you could probably whack somebody in, in the head with. So, yeah. See you guys later.